So they told me I was only gonna have four minutes, so if it's all right, I was just gonna focus all my questions on uh, Judd Apatow's penis. Let's do uh, it. Great. Yeah. Smart. Yeah. Yeah. Smart. Yeah. So well, I good read... luck getting done in four minutes. You know what I mean? <laughs> we'll do an hour on that. It's a lengthy subject. <laughs> <laughs> Minute for every inch. Oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> that was, that so Please. is that really Judd Apatow's penis, or was this just a brilliant I promo mean, stunt? We'll never tell, but you should ask him. If you ask him, like he'll tell you the truth. And, and, on and I'm gonna guess his answer is gonna be yes. And hypothetically speaking, if you were a big Hollywood producer, yeah. and you wanted to hire a body double with a really nice dick, and then yeah. make him sign a non-disclosure agreement, yes, would yes. the public ever find out that that's not your penis? I guess it depends like what kind of moolah we're talking about. Yeah. What kind of wampum are we slapping seen, down in whose palm? Yeah. Possible. The wampum, the wampum gets, he makes it rain on the set, you know what I mean? Uh -huh. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. let's just say everyone's pockets He's fine in the wampum department. Suffice it to say, we're acting a little slippery about this. <laughs> <laughs> How long did it take to shoot Judd Apatow's day? If we did indeed do yeah, it. Yes, if we which did. we're not saying we did. So I would guess if you were going to oh. shoot it, I would say, you know, a couple hours. A couple hours? Yeah, yeah, a couple hours. But it did get, it did get cold later, and I think he, he held up nicely. Was there makeup involved? I don't uh, know the answer to that maybe question. Maybe there might have been some powder. There might have been a little, yeah, it little, just little been powder, powder just yeah. to, you know. And they had to cover up the tattoo. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. He's got some weird kind of, um, let's just say German World War II <laughs> right. kind of stuff. And then, there's like some, there. and then there's like some shamrock stuff, and then he has one of, it's a gnome uh, on a mushroom, and then he's smoking like a hookah and blowing yeah. out smoke, and uh, in the smoke it says Apatow. Like a yeah. Alice in Wonderland. Yeah, kind of kind of, yeah, yeah, exactly. Kind of like, yeah, he's just mixed uh, in. He's just into the, yeah, I think he got it in college. Do you have to take any precautions to keep Judd Apatow's dick from leaking out into the media? You don't want it leaking out in any regard. No. <laughs> No, it's disgusting. <laughs> like on set, we were all praying that it wasn't going to start leaking out. <laughs> we wanted things bone dry, so to speak. Right. So that it would really like stick to the window. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it would just be all nice and legal. Mm -hmm. There's yeah. a nice shutter to it. Mm -hmm. Was there any post-production <laughs> effects uh, applied to Judd Apatow's dick? No, no it was all practical. All, all practical. practical. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We really just did the scene. Two cameras, him, me. I will say though, different stuff. That was very on the level, we shot it with a prosthetic as well, in case people were uncomfortable. Is it easier to get an R rating if uh, the dick is prosthetic? It, it, this is interesting. The, the MPAA saw the movie and they were so excited about that scene in particular that they actually had a, a meeting whether they wanted to make it G just because they wanted to like <laughs> have everyone see right. this in America. Right. Yeah. And then they like a bunch of those people got fired and then the regular people came in and they were like, this is rated R. Mm -hmm. That's true. Yeah. Without confirming or denying whether that's actually Judd Apatow's take, dick. Uh, this we will whole never thing do. is about it. I love this. <laughs> If you were just picking a dick off the rack, yeah. yeah, yeah, wouldn't you pick one with a shaft that's more proportional to the head than, than this one in the movie? See, oh, well, this is an age-old question. This is just we about. We had chose a very wang pref. Mm -hmm. This yeah. is a wang pref mm -hmm. off the rack just... kind of a question. Yeah, I, th I thought it was fairly proportional. Let's just be really clear about this. We didn't. We don't um, subscribe to uh, wang nepotism, right. and we right. made you know. And this is actually to. Uh, well, Judd's credit, his integrity uh, as filmmakers and our own, yeah. that, uh, for, for months he was sending us pics uh, before we had actually even written the scene. Mm -hmm. He was just sending them out, letting us, you know, hey, just, you know, this is here for you guys if you like, want to use no it. No pressure, I'm no here. No pressure. I'm yeah. ready. This is something. It'd be like, a, you know, Martin Sheen will be in the movie if you mm -hmm. need him to be. Mm -hmm. Also, here's the pick again, just in case you <laughs> want to use it. Did you have to and, send it from other people's phones, like Tori Spelling when she had to audition for 90210? Oh, yeah. Name, oh, so yeah. you wouldn't no. know. I heard she won that part fair and square. Mm -hmm. Right. Did this you hear a, otherwise? I, no, that's what I heard. This also. is a very okay. similar situation because he said, just throw it in the mix. <laughs> We got all the different uh, auditions, if you will. Mm -hmm. We looked at them all, and we uh, looked at them vigorously. Yeah, yeah, over and over, and repeatedly. Weeks of looking through these, and uh, they none of them had names. You didn't know who they were, and he would send them in different lighting, different scenarios. Mm -hmm. Here it is if the scene takes place during the day. Here it is at night. Here if, if it's grass or in the city. What if it's uh, underwater? You know, yeah, yeah. Here's, here's what this thing. looks like. When you could yeah. yeah. like smash could, on some glass. And you could so, almost say it was a blind taste test. Right. You could definitely say that. And would you say that it was a meritocracy? Sure. Yeah, you mm -hmm. could say that. Yeah. yeah. No, I like that. Yeah, if you wanted to, you could say that. I think I mean, you're right in league with what like we're you saying. You could say that. I would never say that. <laughs>
It's All my right. say. He All right, won, we won the role. <laughs> yeah. If it is indeed him, he won the role fair and square. But it also might not be him because we didn't look at the names, and then uh, we made the person doing have a bad. Plus, on when we were filming the scene, we were so in character. Yeah. All three of us. It was are just a hardcore fan. method actors, obviously. Yeah. But also, we're in. We're all three in the car. It just you can't see above, so we don't. We don't know who it was. Yeah, but it was yeah. Joe. But but it looked exactly like the photo, so it was him. Probably. It delivered, probably. But you guys can tell me the truth off camera. Okay. 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 All right. Fair. It's Judd. <laughs>